Hello everyone and welcome to Know Your Drug, powered by Medi Insights. The ultimate destination for all things of health and wellness from the fascinating world of medicals and pharmaceutical. We are here to guide you on linozolid tablets, exploring the various aspects of linozolid, their usage, dosage, mechanism of action, side effects, and most importantly, essential advice for taking them safely and responsibly. Before we begin, let me emphasize that the content provided in this channel is purely educational. Always consult a healthcare professional for personalized advice regarding medications. Now, let's get started. Use of linozolid tablets. Linozolid tablets are primarily used to treat bacterial infections. They are effective against a variety of bacteria, including methicillin-resistant Staphylococcus aureus and vancomycin-resistant Enterococcus faecium. Linozolid is often prescribed for infections such as pneumonia, skin infections, and certain types of bacterial meningitis. Next, dosage of linozolid tablets. The dosage of linozolid tablets can vary depending on the severity of the infection, the patient's age, weight, and overall health condition. However, the typical recommended dosage for adults is 600 mg every 12 hours, orally. For pediatric patients, the dosage is usually calculated based on their weight and is given in every 8 to 12 hours. It's essential to follow the dosage instructions provided by the healthcare provider or as indicated on the prescription label. Taking more than the prescribed dose or taking it for longer than recommended can increase the risk of side effects and bacterial resistance. Next, Mechanism of Action of Linozolid Tablets Linozolid is an antibiotic belonging to the oxazolidinone class. It works by inhibiting bacterial protein synthesis, specifically by binding to the 23S ribosomal RNA of the 50S subunit of the bacterial ribosome. This action prevents the formation of the initiation complex for protein synthesis, thus halting bacterial growth and replication. Linozolid exhibits bacteriostatic activity against most gram-positive bacteria and some gram-negative bacteria. Next, side effects of linozolid tablets. While linozolid is an effective antibiotic, it can also cause side effects. Common side effects may include nausea and vomiting, diarrhea, headache, insomnia, dizziness, rash or itching, taste disturbance. In rare cases, linozolid may also cause more severe side effects, such as peripheral neuropathy, serotonin syndrome, thrombocytopenia, and optic neuropathy. It's important to contact a healthcare provider if any severe side effects occur while taking linozolid. Next, important advice for using linozolid tablets, finish the entire course of linozolid prescribed by the healthcare provider, even if symptoms improve before completing the medication. Stopping the medication prematurely can lead to the return of the infection or bacterial resistance. Linozolid can interact with certain medications, including monoamine oxidase inhibitors, serotonin reuptake inhibitors, and certain antidepressants. Inform your healthcare provider about all medications, supplements, and herbal products you are taking before starting linozolid. Avoid consuming large amounts of foods rich in tyramine, such as aged cheeses, cured meats, and fermented foods, while taking linozolid, as it can increase the risk of a hypertensive crisis. If you experience any severe side effects or allergic reactions while taking linozolid, seek medical attention immediately. Store linozolid tablets at room temperature away from moisture and heat, and keep them out of reach of children. Inform your healthcare provider if you have any pre-existing medical conditions, such as kidney or liver disease, or if you are pregnant or breastfeeding, before starting linozolid treatment. By the end of this video, you'll have a solid understanding of the use, dosage, mechanism of action, side effects, and important advice for taking linozolid tablets. Remember, knowledge is power, and being well-informed empowers you to make the best decisions for your health.